Hi guys, so what you can probably tell from the title today, I'm going to be teaching you how to install Magic Lantern onto your Canon Rebel T3i or um, some certain other Canon DSLRs. I forget the exact ones that you can do it on, but I'll put a list in the description. So what you're going to need is you're going to need Canon DSLR that can have Magic Lantern installed. You're going to need <coughs> um, an SD card reader for your uh, for your computer because you're going to need to plug your SD card in and have it show up and be able to put Magic Lantern and the Canon firmware on. So I'm just going to use my GoPro because my Mac doesn't have an SD card slot and I don't have the adapter thing. So um, what you're first going to want to do is format the card on your Canon DSLR. So you're going to want to go to the M setting on your camera, hit menu, and go to the third yellow little settings thing, third one, and go to format, um, yes. You can click the delete button for low level format. There we go. So now that you've formatted it, you can put it into your computer. So you can put it into your computer and It'll pop up right here. I don't need those. Okay. So you want to go to this website for the Rebel T3i. Um, if you have a different camera, just search Canon, the camera name, and firmware download. Go to here, go to drivers and software and you want to get this new one right here if you really wanted to you can also get all that stuff that's there too the instruction manual so whether you have a windows or a mac windows mac i'm mac so i'm going to download that agree begin download let's just go like this That will download. Come on. Okay, here we go. You want to open that. And you want to take this and drag it onto your SD card. So that right there, that's for me. That's. Canon something firmware and the version 1.1.102. I think that's what that is. So there, now it's on. You can eject. Make sure you press eject or else you can screw up your uh, SD card. When it, once it has ejected, take the SD card, put it back into your camera. And this is where we will update um, the firmware on your Canon camera. So you go to M, go to menu, um, you want to go to, make sure you're at the M setting. You want to go to this firmware, click OK to update. This will come up. Sorry for the quality of this video of the of the screen. I've already got it updated, I'm pretty sure, but we'll do it anyway just for the sake of the video. As I was saying, sorry for the quality of the 
if you do have the camera screen, I'm videoing it with my uh, iPhone, so, yep, I gotta do that anyway, okay, and there, now it's updated, what you want to do is, um, you want to format it again, because you want that Canon firmware to be off of there. <clears throat> Take out the uh, SD card again. Put it back into your computer. And you want to go to this website, magiclantern.fm. Go to Downloads. Now here is where it'll list. Here's the camera supported. So there's about six cameras. Canon, uh, I think that's the T2. I think that's the T2i. And I'm pretty sure this is the T3. Maybe. Maybe this is the T1. I don't know. Anyway, those are the cameras supported. You want to go download. I agree. And downloads quickly. Where the hell did that go? No, wait. Downloads. Shit, where is it? Oh, here it is. Magic Lantern. Okay, now. There we go. So once you have downloaded Magic Lantern, you want to copy all of this stuff. You don't, probably don't need the install PDF, but whatever. Wait, okay. Now everything is in there. I'm going to eject it. <clears throat> Put it into my camera, turn my camera on, make sure you're on the men M, the manual. Now this better work or else I'm quitting. Firmware update, firmware update. Me. Okay, never mind, it worked. Woo! There we go. So, Magic Lantern is installed, and that is how you do that. Don't make the same mistakes I did. Yeah. Restart your camera when you're done. Wait. And. You can now press the delete button, and you will get all this. There's a bunch of cool things. I personally like the focus peak, and a few others. Anyway, you can play around with it, look for some videos on YouTube. Maybe I'll put some below that show you how to use it and some benefits of it. And yeah, see you later.